Hi guys, Lynn here, and welcome back to another Starfield video. In this one, I wanted to go over the best free ships you can steal after I did a video that you guys enjoyed on the best free ships to find, which were all unique ships. These ships are the ones you can get from the game world and either keep and modify or sell for a profit, and usually you'll get between 3 and say 12,000 credits at most once you've taken them to the vendors. But what ships can you steal, how do you steal them, and how much do they sell for? Let's take a look. So really there are two main methods to get ships by stealing them. The first, and this does not require any skill, all you need to do is land on planets and moons, and many times when you land, another ship will land nearby right away, and you can hand over there. Not all ships you can come across are accessible, but many are, and you can simply head inside, kill the people, and take the ship. The place you do this doesn't matter, ships will show up in locations across the galaxy. Of course, you will need to have the required piloting level to get class B and class C ships to steal. And if you land on a planet and a ship doesn't spawn in, usually if you scan and head to the nearest structure, a ship will often spawn in then. So the second method is to disable a ship when it's in orbit around a planet and then you can board them. To do this however you will need skill targeting to disable the engines of the other vessel and then you can simply get within 500 meters and board them like you can a space station. When you do board a ship one thing to remember is to loot the captain's locker and cargo hold because they're usually full of credits and other armors and weapons and I assume you're doing this for the money. So make sure to take all the loot before you sell them. To sell the ships then, simply take them to the local vendor. Now to stop players earning millions of credits every hour from the vendors, they force you to pay a large fee to register your ship before you can sell it, but you will still make a profit on every ship, and of course the commerce skill will help you earn more. The most you can make is probably around 12,000 credits, which is the most I've had so far. Also before selling, note that some of the ships have contraband on board, especially if it's a pirate ship and then you can't take those into spaces or you will be discovered and then you will have to pay a fine, but you will get to keep the ship. Lastly then, what are the ships you can find and steal? Well, there are two things here. First, the planet ships. These are super easy to know because nearly all of them are sold by the Crimson Fleet or Red Mile vendors. You can see them on screen now and some are very high priced and you can get up to maybe 10,000 credits for selling the better ones. The Autobahn, the Conqueror, the Varun ship are all some of the best ones you can discover. Or this one I discovered here, the Civ Shuttle 2, that was a very good one to discover. But all of these ships you can see in the infantry screen are all possible finds on planets. The more expensive ones you can find, then the better they are. Plus of course there are more than you can see here, these are just the ones the vendor has right now. They reset and you have a chance to find different ships that I haven't shown you here, like the pickup which I have here, which is one of the more expensive class A ships. So these are the type of ships you will find when you go on the planets and the more expensive ones are the ones you want. For ships you find in space however, well that's a little less clear. The ships are really, are nearly all faction battleships, then you can come across random ships like we mentioned the same as the ones on the planet, but you can also come across random other ships as well because I came across the Kepler R and I thought this was a unique ship, but maybe it's possible you can find any of the regular spaceships out in space. So maybe you can find Narwhal or a Dragonfire or something like that. But the problem is finding ships in space is very uncommon unless it's a faction battleship like the Freestar Collective or Spacers or something like that. So ultimately we'll just have to wait and see because finding civilian ships like I did with the Kepler R here is just too uncommon to have enough info on what will spawn in space. It is good to know that there are some different types of things that you could discover. And best of all for the Kepler R here I got the most credits I had for any ship so far which was 12,000. Another possibility of course is that the ships that will spawn in space are also all the ones that you own because I do own a Kepler R. But again I just haven't discovered enough ships in order to be able to tell if that's true or not. But you can let me know in the comments below if you've discovered any other types of ships that are not in the Red Mile vendor, Crimson Fleet, one of the faction ships or one that you currently own. But we will just have to wait and see. Guys like and subscribe for more Starfield guides and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Good day, Captain.